you today's video sponsor will be Tuver, and these guys were kind enough to send out a free phone case to do a review on my Galaxy SN Plus, so thank you so much for that. I've had some time to check out the phone case, see what the features are all about. I'm pretty excited about it, so let's just jump right to the review. All right, so getting into the phone case here. The phone case overall is a good quality build. I am impressed by that. It's sort of like this like hard rubber plasticky type of material, which is excellent. On the back, it's gonna have this faux leather sort of material. Also not bad. It does feel pretty durable as far as I'm concerned. Jumping right into the build quality here. Overall, the build quality is satisfactory. The case is pretty well built, like I said. You do have this kickstand strap that you can sort of use as a kickstand. All of the ports are easily accessible towards the bottom and whatnot. The power button is obviously located right here and the volume rockers list is located right here on the sides along with the Bixby button. I am a fan of the case. It has a raised edge display so you can essentially set your phone case down just like that on a flat surface. The surface won't make contact with the screen which is going to be excellent if you don't have a screen protector on there due to again the raised edges so nice that they included that. So again jumping right into the strap right here on the back of the phone case you'll find that it has like a small pouch. Pretty much just drop in a business card in there, a credit card, whatever you want. So it holds all of your cards. It does come with that strap which another thing to talk about is also going to be the wireless charging feature if you are using that type of charging for your Galaxy S10 Plus. I would recommend probably taking out the cards uh, especially if you have a ton of them stacked in there. It's going to play a bit of a inhibiting factor in terms of getting that charger to actually charge the phone itself. I did find a few difficulties with that when I had a ton of cards in the actual pouch. So if you just take out the cards or something or if you don't have a ton of cards on there you won't necessarily bump into a bunch of problems with it but do take that into consideration that you'll have to set the phone case somewhat centered on the charging pad so that might be a contributing factor in terms of whether or not it charges or not so phone case does come with a strap type of lanyard with a clip on it didn't really use that per se i'm not necessarily like a fan of that personally but again if you do want to use that it is an option so if you are going to be taking pictures for example and you want to wrap your arm around that to give you some extra security onto the phone case overall i am very pleased with this phone case it's aesthetically pleasing it's cool it's sleek it's slim it's not necessarily something that's going to protrude from your phone if you are looking for a quality phone case i do recommend this phone case i'm probably gonna be rocking it for a little bit longer here I did enjoy it. All right, guys, so that's pretty much it. If you enjoyed the video, you know what to do. And if you are interested in picking up one of these cases, it is JB Reviews approved. I'll leave all the affiliate information linked down below in the description. Again, thank you so much for Tuvern for sponsoring today's video. Thank you for the product. Guys, again, it's JB Reviews. I'll catch you next time.